Assalamu alaikum. Welcome to Path of the Prophets. Today we are at St. Catherine's Monastery um, at Jebel Musa, Mount Sinai. And it's a it's an interesting place. And it's interesting to even contemplate monasticism. You know, monasticism is often related to asceticism. And the word asceticism is related to the word athleticism. An ascetic is a spiritual athlete. So this is Zuhud. And it would, you know, a person who is engaged in asceticism will often be, they'll have a, a, a life of contemplation, contemplating nature, the inner and outer nature, praying, especially late night prayers, standing in prayer, bowing, prostrating, um, fasting a lot. Sometimes fasting from words, fasting from speech, so utilizing silence. Um, sometimes singing hymns until the late, you know, through the wee hours. Um, they, many of the Christian monastics, they pattern themselves, their, their prayer life on Nabi Dawud alayhi salam, who prayed, um, in, in some texts he prayed three times a day, but in others he prayed seven times a day. So he had three official prayers and then four others. But it's interesting that when you think about our prayers, we pray five times a day. If you add in the mid-morning prayer, that's six. And then if you include the night prayer, I mean the, the late night prayer, um, then you've got seven. So it's interesting that it matches up with Nebi Dawud alayhi salam and um, you know, roughly equates to the Christian monastic tradition. So anyway, it's, it, it's, it's very interesting to be in a monastic setting. Um, this is an Orthodox uh, monastery, I believe Greek Orthodox. But before that, I believe the Georgians were here, the Coptics were here. Um, you know, correct me if I'm wrong, I haven't studied this one in depth. Um, and it's, it's fascinating to me. So we'll discuss monasticism in some other videos soon, inshallah. Until then, assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.